Orange County Registered Digital. The Mark Twain steam-powered paddle wheeler is one of the oldest attractions at Disneyland and is one of the most unique to operate. One of the main things that we do up here, as well as entertaining our guests, is looking out for other watercrafts around the river. That way, we can signal to the engineer to stop the boat. That's right, they signal, just like the crew on paddle wheelers did on the Mississippi years ago. Pilot house rings me, because the pilot watches where we're going. I can't really see much. The pilot in the wheelhouse perched on top of the ship has to keep a weather eye on things while the ship steams around the rivers of America. I grew up on a boat and so it wasn't anything super out of my element. I do know the nautical laws. Since these are the biggest watercrafts on the river, we call them the big boats, we do have the right of way. The Mark Twain may have the right of way, but they have to let the other watercraft know they're coming. Our first set of bells and whistles indicates to the rafts up ahead that we are leaving the docks. Meanwhile, on the first level, an engineer is responsible for making the ship run. Steam comes through the pipe, goes through this valve, can, splits off, goes to each engine. The more steam we give it, the faster we move. Besides watching the scenery, park visitors can actually ride in the wheelhouse with the pilot. We bring people up into the wheelhouse each and every trip that the Mark Twain takes, unless of course it's uh, raining quite heavily. But it's pretty much first come, first serve. We do have a logbook for our guests to sign. I encourage them to write their name, where they're from, the date of their piloting experience. Here's the proof of my trip in the wheelhouse of the Mark Twain. All ashore that are going ashore. This is Mark Eads reporting for OCRegister.com. Orange County Register. We are here in the service of Orange County.